This is the News Now webcast for Friday, October 15th. I'm Katie Vance. Saturday, the Frogs take on BYU at 3 o'clock. The game is part of the sixth annual Frogs for the Cure, benefiting Susan G. Komen and investing in breast cancer awareness and research. This year's annual halftime production will feature the music video, We Fight Back, by TCU alumnus, singer-songwriter, Tim Halperin. This is a preview of the video. We're gonna survive. The song is available on iTunes and Halpern will donate 70 cents of each download to Susan G. Komen. Following the Frogs for the Cure football game, Halpern will perform a free concert in Frog Alley. Other campus organizations are also contributing to the cause. The Student Trainers Association, Zeta Tau Alpha, and PR for the Cure put pink flamingos in front yards throughout Fort Worth. The pink flamingo flockings are taking place throughout the week and for a $100 donation, you can send the flock to a friend's yard. The Frogs aren't the only team to see this weekend. The Texas Rangers play the New York Yankees at 7 o'clock at Rangers Ballpark in the first game of the American League Championship Series. Students using the library between midnight and 7 a.m. will now have to swipe their ID cards at the front door and the turnstile entrance. The library is reserved exclusively for students after midnight. An Associated Press and MTVU poll found that President Obama is losing support among college students. Only 44% of students approve of the job Obama is doing. That is a significant drop from the 60% that approved in May 2009. Obama is speaking at universities and town halls broadcast on MTV, CMT, and BET leading up to the November 2nd midterm elections in an effort to rally the support of young voters. That's all for today's webcast. Thanks for watching. I'm Katie Vance.